Hi, so here's the uh, IPX view IP system. So here we have the settings. We have two HDMI inputs and four HDMI outputs. Then we connect to the uh, POE switch here. Then over this side, we have the uh, four, uh, two by two, and then we have four screens. And this is my PC. For my PC mainly, we'll just use to how to set up uh, and make this system working as a uh, two input for outputs video uh, matrix switcher. So on the UI designer, basically we need to have the settings. And firstly, we just need to uh, add a new page. Like right now, uh, where do you add one? We can just delay this one first. So on this new page, we just drag the matrix switcher down here. And we can just adjust the size to make it a little bit fit with the, the page. And uh, on this setting, and basically we can see uh, we have the setting here. So we need to choose the video, uh, the matrix switcher inside. And once we choose this one, and then we can see we have the settings here. And if we want to make a two by two, so we just choose as two rows or four columns. Just because right now I have two transmitters. So we just put it as two. And for the mode, and we're going to switch video and audio at the same time. Okay, so we just tickle the audio and the video. On this side, we also see uh, the input will change to inputs and for outputs. And next step, we're going to just stack the uh, input one. See, once we click the uh, input one, and it's changed to the uh, blue letters, and then we can see here we have the uh, input list. So we just choose this one. And after we click that one, actually this one already changed to the, to the IP address. If you want to change the name, we also can just change the names here. Okay, so this one we put as maybe, uh, this is my Apple TV box. So Apple TV. Okay, so here we can see the name was changed. And input two, the same thing. We just click, click the input two. Then here we just tickle the, uh, choose this transmitter. And name here we change to the uh, camera. Okay, so we already have the input setting and the output is going to be the same. So choose this one, and we have this one. We just choose the IP address accordingly. Four. Okay, so now that means we already have the uh, matrix setting done. Then next I will just click to upload. Click OK. Then we we'll just wait about like uh, two or five minutes to upload in the design to the uh, NSPC or the application country. Okay. So here we need to make sure and once we select not to select like the whole page and we need to select only in this part, only this the uh, Matrix setting part. So then we can just bound the input and output uh, with the IP address on the this side. Okay. When we uploading the the, the, the configuration, we normally we, we cannot do the uh, we we don't recommend to press the move or do any settings on this one. So after the setting uploaded successfully, then we will choose up this upload succeed. Then we we'll just Minimize this window, then go back to the country software and SPC, then we can just do the country links. And we need to make sure it's uh, using our own uh, country PC IP address. Then we we'll click, oh, sorry. Then we we'll just click to log in. So when we log in, we can see this uh, just the same interface we designed. And we can just press the button, then we can do the uh, switchings. Okay, so this is the, uh, from my camera, and this is from the Apple TV box. Okay, we'll just make it, uh, zoom it a little bit so we can check out. So we do the switchings for Okay, so we also can save them as the presets. So save the presets and we just put as on. Okay.
okay and all are showing the same from the Apple TV box save as the uh, preset 2 okay and the save as uh, other presets okay so we can just record the different presets okay so this uh the uh, about the matrix feature on the ipx so basically the settings from the ui designer and we just found the uh, input with the transmitter IP address then the uh, output with the uh, receiver IP address then upload then we can use the IPC to capture thank you